Robin, I have a question for you because uh, Tom and I were talking earlier at, just about all the different sort of teammates that I've had uh, in my 15 years in the league. Are there any, because <clears throat> I, I get asked this all the time, like who's the best teammate you ever had? Who's the worst teammate you have? Silly questions like that. But have there been any teammates that you've had whose sort of real life persona was the exact opposite of what their reputation was? That's that's a good question because there's been a there's been a lot of guys I thought I wouldn't get just, I thought I wouldn't get along with like somebody this year when the Wizards picked up Alex Len it's like oh my god I hate that guy you know we're both we're both we've been occasionally starting centers and reserve centers and we've just gone at each other's necks and I was oh my god I hate that guy he's such a jackass and and we picked him up and he's just lovely he's a peach you know. <laughs> So I have a lot. I think I have a decent, I have a decent number of examples like that, but somebody who's the complete opposite of what was advertised. I, I just know, I know, I know we have the title for the podcast now. JJ Reddick, old man in the three episode 127. <laughs> Alex Len is a jackass. <laughs> If that's not clickbait, I don't know what is. Sometimes, sometimes it's one sided. But he he said he 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 communicated communicated the same thing to me. Oh wow! wow. Yeah, which was kind of interesting. Wow! Yeah. I thought you were going to go with Alex Len as a peach. That's what I thought you were going to go with. <laughs> <laughs> that's not going to get those clicks, man. I was going to bring up Rajon Rondo because you hear everywhere that like he's such a such a tough guy in the locker room and, and such a cancer. I found him to be the exact opposite. I, I, you know, he's very outspoken, but I really, I really loved, I, I adored playing with Rajon. And I think every, I think everybody in the locker room would attest to that. This isn't the case a hundred percent of the time, but in my experience that a lot of the guys that people write about or people talk about as being bad guys or bad teammates, when you talk to their teammates, they're like, oh no, he's the best. Mm -hmm. I love that guy. So mm -hmm. for sure. What was your guys' first impression of Giannis? Before I met him, I, I just I just noticed how quiet he was, um, how how single minded he seemed on the court. I just I've always had the nothing but good things to say about Giannis. He's uh, you know, world class, one of the best basketball players in the world, but an even better person. Like there's, there's nothing bad you can say about him. I do remember one of the first times I played him in Brooklyn. He blocked my shot so hard, and this was like must have been like his first or second year. So I guess I didn't read the scouting report that night or didn't really pay attention to you know. But I mean, obviously with his length and everything in his athleticism, I was just going up for like a routine layup or I turned to my left shoulder, like right pivot to go up. And he came in and blocked my shot so hard and pinned it against the backboard in Brooklyn. I was like shocked. Like I just like it, the ball went out of bounds somehow. And I turned around. And I was like, how did you block me? How did you block my shot that hard? And so one of the first things I asked him when I got signed in Milwaukee was, do you remember this play? Like it literally like stuck in my mind. Like it was just violent. And he's like, yeah, I, I do that. but yeah, that's, that's my guy. Robin, what do you mean by single minded? It seemed like all he's like, see, he seemed like the Terminator on the point. I know it's an overused cliche, but he seemed like completely mm -hmm. focused on, on doing his job on the basketball court. As if, as if being a theatric and a thespian wasn't for him. It wasn't about that for him. It wasn't <laughs> about the all. entertainment. Yeah. No, I, well, I mean, so, 